Okay, guess where we're biking on a date today? Look out, hot diggity dog, it's Disney World! <laughs> Hi, me and Lindsay are on a little bike ride, and by little, I mean 17 miles. Um, Lindsay goes to Wicked very soon, and we're trying to get as many fun day dates in while George is in school. So today, we are riding bikes from our home in Windermere, 8.7 miles. I love it to Disney Springs and we're gonna have lunch at the boathouse it's gonna be awesome and uh, then we're gonna go back so we can eat really whatever we want and then ride back and it's 8.7 miles each way so it's just over 17 miles I love it fitness day day let's do it we got to change of clothes on Lindsay's bike and a cute hat because we're gonna be sweaty. It pays to look sharp. It does pay to look sharp. It's mid-August, it's really hot in Florida. Like What's that? It's gonna be like full steam. <laughs> right? This little pond usually has a gator in it. Yeah. Gators are like the squirrels of Florida. Yeah. They're everywhere. a good day date adventure activity like if I could choose between having brunch in a restaurant or riding a bike and eating a sandwich on the side of a hill or something I would definitely pick the latter but you know I'm we're trying to find some good like fitness opportunities because honestly y'all we gained that COVID-19 just like everybody else and um, I have to fit into all those costumes at Wicked. Now the word on the street is they're like happy to alter them, but that's gonna be a dark moment. Well, I'll bring you along for that process. I'm crossing the street, look both ways, everybody. Um, but you know what? I would like them to have to do as little work as possible. Shout out to the stitchers and wardrobe professionals at Wicked. So this is a great way for us to hang out. I also get to eat more cheese. So like more miles, more cheese. That's what I'm saying. And everything's flat in Florida, so you can ride a bike for like three hours and like, it's not hard. It's After right. a year of homeschooling, mm -hmm. now Georgia's in school for six hours, right? Amazing. Like we've been together and in charge of our child 24 hours a day for like 18 months. And now we drop her off at school and she's there from 8.30 to 3. And it's like kind of amazing. I'm into it, she's into it. As long as she doesn't get COVID, we're good. She might. Listen. I'm into it. Woo! We're vaccinated. Hey! So we live 8.7 miles from Disney Springs by way of the highway, but we're actually two miles from the back of Magic Kingdom. Uh, Cinderella Castle. So over here behind me where that house is, behind that tree line, is Disney property and uh, Fort Wilderness. It's right over there. So we're actually going on the east side of Disney property, all the way down past uh, Saratoga Spring and all the uh, executive offices and stuff. So this is a really fun bike ride. And it's right by a highway, but the path is really safe and awesome. And it's a beautiful Toy Story Cloud day. There's some total Anglophiles that live here. Um, they named their street Penny Lane Drive. From the United yeah, you see, Penny Lane, there is a barber selling photographs. Of every head he's had the pleasure. To. Penny Lane, private. And then there's a uh, there's a phone booth, right? A British phone booth up here. Yeah. <laughs> really awesome. Let's build a house right here. That looks fun. It could just be our southern vacation home. Live in New York. There's a swing tree. Amazing. It's gonna be our vacation home and the pop down. I love it. Hi. Oh, you're doing good. Can I ring? <laughs> Here are the goats. There are always goats for sale here. Is that a business? Hi, goats. One goat, 
golden goat for sale. Oh, and there's the telephone booth. Hi there. There's the British telephone booth, who knows? Okay, now we're at this cool part of Disney property where there are public roads. And if you want to take a shortcut over to the Four Seasons over there or Fort Wilderness or the cabins, uh, or cut through to Magic Kingdom or Epcot, you cut through right over here. This blue building behind me is where they do all the laundry for Walt Disney World. It's not on site, they bring it over here to the edge of property on the other side of the street. Pretty cool. Okay, six miles in, we are almost there. Lindsay's loving this. We're just around the river bend. <laughs> just around the corner, we'll be at Disney Springs. All right, there's Remy, savor a festival of flavor at Epcot. Okay, now we're here in the land of the tourists with the IHOP and the Disney t-shirts. <laughs> we're crazy. We are crazy, you all realize that, right? We're crazy. And Advent Health, the official healthcare partner of Walt Disney World, right here. We're almost at Disney Springs. COVID results in minutes. All right, we made it all the way to I-4. And here's the Disney sign. We could bike to Typhoon Lagoon. <laughs> I wish it was open. Maybe they'll. Bike on the way there, but on the way back in a bathing suit, not so much. Well, I guess you could bring. Be real chafy. Take some baby powder. Okay, there's Disney Springs right there. We're gonna take the elevator up and take the bridge over. Amazing. Resort area, Disney Springs. Thank you, thank you. All right, so this little pedestrian bridge crosses this street and the street to Disney Springs. Let's do it. There's our bridge. Whee! It doesn't say no bikes. So. And yeah, let's go for it. We made it. Okay, I never thought I'd have a bicycle in a uh, Disney Springs elevator. It's a first for me. And yet here we are. Do you need my mask on? Not yet. So we're inside, I guess. How cool is this? Dig it. It feels like Paris, right? <laughs> You're gonna ride your bike over the bridge. <laughs> so there is to the right is Saratoga Springs Hotel Resort and there's the Disney Springs sign. Amazing. Are we the only weirdos that do this? <laughs> to bring our bikes <laughs> to Disney Springs. Ooh, too funny. Okay. We parked our bikes up there because I felt like taking them down the elevator where we'd like to leave them in Disney Springs. I've never seen anybody on their bike in I've Disney never Springs. Seen another bike in Disney Springs. <laughs> this is nice. This is where the uh, other temperature check used to be. Oh, yeah. Oh, hand Santa. Hand Santa, yay. Just going by itself. Of course. There it goes. 
<laughs> Georgia would love that splash pad. Boop, boop. Remember that time me and Georgia did all the rides at Disney yeah. Springs? Yeah. Disney Springs Grand Slam. Whoop, whoop. I think it's whoop. a perfect day. Margaritas. You're welcome. Okay, we're wearing our masks because Lindsay can't get Delta before she goes to Broadway. And you have to wear them indoors, but this you can wear them called, outdoors too. This is what it's called, a crown. And yeah. that is where it's you go. True. Although daytime Disney Springs is way less busy. Way than, less busy. It's awesome. I than was nighttime Disney one Springs. Time and it was like really chill. Yeah, when it opened, right? Yeah. But yeah, Paddlefish and uh, Boathouse, where we're going to Boathouse today, their first lunch reservation I think is at 11. So. Um, so you have brunch on the weekends, right? Yeah, and, Dis and Disney Springs opens at 10. So. Yeah. We're just a notch late for our reservation. We got to walk fast. At the boathouse. I don't think I, I don't think I've ever eaten here. Have after, I? after all, uh, I haven't either. After all that bike riding, I'm not like super hungry. But, uh, I am. I'll right. eat your food. Okay, sounds good. Look at the dragon. A dragon. I really saw a dragon. Name that movie. Pete's Dragon. Pete's Dragon. That's right. Pineapple upside down cake. Yeah. That's the vegan bakery, right? No, 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 no. I'm wearing my vacation hat right now that I got right there. We and love a vacation hat. Chapel hats or chapel hats, I don't know. Bob Chapel? <laughs> Here's the boathouse. Yay! So. It probably won't change, right? Probably not. I mean, are you gonna change? I don't know. I'm think gonna so. feel it out. I'm gonna look around. Okay. Well, we definitely should check in first. We are 14 minutes late. This store is also where you can rent one of the uh, boats and have a captain take oh. you out on the water. And, uh, it's $125 for three people, so for a boat full. So, um, for your special occasion, it's expensive. And, uh, but if you want to see that, check it out. Our episode is called cool. The Disney Springs Grand Slam. We did the Aerophile and the boats. What are the boats called? Georgia would know. They're the, um, the boats. <laughs> hey, babe. What's the. Really fancy stuff. <laughs> so I totally voted for us to sit outside, even though there was a little bit of a wait, because that is one really pretty easy way you can stay a little bit safer. We've had a lot of people asking us like, ooh, is now a good time to come? I'm thinking about canceling my trip. But if you do decide to come, always eating outside is like an easy way to up your safety quotient. So I'll wait. It's so Mm, look at them rolls. Parker House roll. Boop boop. Hi. It is bumping in here at lunch, man. Beautiful. Hi, ladies. Regatta dining. This is so cool. Thank you so much. All right. Lovely. Thank you, Justin. That's what I'm talking about, Lince. We have the virtual menu and look at the boat out there. Amphicar, Amphicar, that's what they're called. There's Saratoga Springs, the largest resort at Disney World. And we got to review that for Lindsay's 40th birthday. Mm. Lindsay, there's a volcano behind you, so just warning. Is the floor lava?
Okay, we got some fresh rolls. Yeah. Delicious. Um, this is a hard reservation to get. The boathouse and um, paddlefish. paddlefish are very hard. They're actually also... The springs in general these days is kind of hard to get in the summer. Yeah. Yeah. But these are more, you know, more pricey meals, but it's also really nice. I was surprised at how many people are here having lunch. Yeah. What day of the week is it? It's a Thursday. Thursday. Friday. Today's it's Friday, Friday though. Today's Friday yeah. at lunchtime. Um, but here's a pro tip. Are you ready for the pro tip? Um, my Disney experience had no reservations here before two o'clock. I called and it said, you know, you can check on uh, open table. So I looked on open table and the time that I wanted was available. So I think that they hold reservations on open table yeah. and then they hold some for my Disney experience. I got wine bar George on open table too on Christmas Day. Also, our travel agent, uh, Melanie Frady, the travel nation, told us to always call the restaurants here at Disney Springs and sometimes they'll they'll be on like, ah, oh, yeah, we have a couple. Yeah. So um, also helps to call. So if it doesn't show it on my Disney experience, just just give them a call or check out Open Table because that's how yeah. we got this great table yeah. and we're eating outside safely, right? Lovely. How's the bread? Ready? It's good. There's like honey on the top. Is it warm? Mm-hmm. Oh, it's warm. Okay. Hey, I love that they have like eight Floridian beers, right? Yeah, this isn't the one I ordered. Really? No. Florida Avenue? It looks like it's exclusive to Boathouse. Great. Uh, you know what? I think I'm going to love it. I think this is going to be a happy accident. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It looks like lively. I bet you like mine even more. Mine looks a little bit darker. Mm -hmm. I'm more of a dark beer lady. I am. I like mine like a little Croy flavored. Mm. I like both. I think yours might be a little heavier. But. Yummy. It's cool. Delicious. Isla Morada. I'm like, which one did I order? Nice. Okay, pro tip, they did bring the long, wrong beer for Lindsay. And pro tip, split the wedge salad, right? Yeah. They're like, we'll split it for salad. you. Huge I wedge think salad. I probably put way more blue cheese and bacon on it when you split it. That's really nice. Mm. Well, uh, This is a sad... Now you got a free beer. <laughs> That's what he said. You're never going to be able to bike back. <laughs> yeah, I'm not going to be able to drink those. Boop. I got the right beer. This is the Persimmon Hollow Beach Hippie. And I was like, that sounds the right cool. Beer it's a local and the IPA. Right it's a little bit more bitter than Jared Lang. IPA is definitely a real beer drinker. Like me. I like it. Oh yeah, it's got that bitter bite on the side of your tongue. It's stronger too. Look at my really ultra cool Disney Cruise Line shirt. Isn't that amazing? Oh yeah, I love it. Look at these flams. That garlic toast is amazing. The salad is great. Does everybody else when they get clams sing, look at them clams? When they're getting on some sauna. From Carousel? Look, no, look at my, look at my truffle fries that smell mm. amazing. And this, look at that filet mignon with like butter on it. This it is looks great. very good. How are we gonna, it's like two steaks. We've got another eight miles to go back home and pick up Georgia from school. <laughs> But babe, I'm celebrating you because you're going back to Broadway. Oh, I love and you. I love you. It's my favorite game. No, no. Exercise and food. Fancy food. Okay. It's very warm. It looks like the flay's been sliced again in half. What are your thoughts? That looks very rich. I think they just dumped some butter on it. It looks like it was poached in butter. Do wow. you think that's a possibility? You have to try that. You know, for research. Better than a burger. <laughs> Have a blowout on 535. Yep. <laughs> um, the dominant flavor there is butter. Amazing. Yeah. Really, it's really good. good. Now for the truffle fry. Let's see. It's very rich. I would not be able to eat both of those in my life. The truffle fries do not need any kind of sauce, although I am going to dip it in the sauce. There's a boat going by. Hi guys. Hey everybody. I love them. They're so cute. They're really cute and they're $125 for, but it's no. fun. It's a once in a lifetime thing. Maybe it's something they always wanted to do. Me and Georgia did that 
that I'm glad I did it, but it's something you do once. Thank you, Family Travel, for doing that. <laughs> Sending us on that. Mm. Mm, the fries are it. I know you want some. Get in there. X. Okay, so how are the clams? Really good. You love clams. Not fishy. Nice and garlicky. And Your mom garlic. like grills them. You guys yeah. used to do that all the time in Emerald Isle, right? Yeah. Mm. I gotta say, Lynn, I love, yeah. I love a fitness date with you. Yeah. You ride bikes for fitness, and then I'm about a fitness in my mouth. Mm -hmm. mm. You see the so juices funny. in there? <laughs> Green juice. I had a green juice on our bike. I promise. I, I didn't saw film it. it. I saw it. But I had it, so I tried. You know mm. I tried. Okay, as I'm heading outside, I gotta say, that was a 10 out of 10 experience eating at the boathouse. Um, it was wonderful. I can't wait to go back and have like a celebration dinner there, like, because it's expensive. But to go over there and have like a nice, you know, the entrees there are 30 to 50, 60 bucks. So, but uh, that was great for lunch. It was affordable. My filet mignon thing was 14 bucks. And uh, it's a lot of fun. I recommend the boathouse. If you want to do something really special, take one of the Amphicars out right here. <laughs> wow, this is going to be cool. I just got really excited. Yeah. Did you get excited? Yeah, I got excited. Wait till we hit the water, then you're really gonna get excited. We're gonna go in the water? Yeah! Cool. And keep the video running, because you may never, you, you don't know what you're gonna see at the bottom of the lake. Oh, uh oh! Uh -oh. The bottom of the lake! <laughs> okay, here we go! Say bye, everybody! Here we go! Georgia, we're going in the water! <laughs> wow! Okay, Lindsay is about to check out on her phone and grab a bag and just walk out of the store. Isn't that cool? Just through the app, the My Disney Experience app. Yeah. Okay, start okay. shopping. Okay, and go. Roll the me. Yeah, it's cool. Let's see how you do this. Whoa! So are we an annual pass holder or vacation club? No, I wish. Oh, well, when you do, it'll, the discounts will automatically apply. It's really cool. Oh, That's sweet. That's neat. Thank you, David. Okay, and then I just put my password in. Yep. Great. I won't show that. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Let me get my That's a neat. That's a neat thing. At the holidays, the line can be 20 minutes to get out of here or more. So that's a really great way. To check out at the Disney store now. So as long as you have the My Disney Experience app, you can do it. All right. You show your code here. Get a little bag. That is so sweet. And then you would be able to take off like. Don't tell. Don't tell anybody. But that's going to be a present for Georgia. Maybe a Disney Dad trivia present. Um, if she wins again, and we all know she's going to win again. Um, but that's really cool. So they said they would take off security tags and stuff. Yeah. So. If you purchase an item with a security tag, they'll remove it at the door of that associate. Um, and they can also wrap like, you know, fragile things like mugs, dishes, and tissue paper up there. They got yeah. bags. I, that was cool. Yeah, it's a they're very- They're just testing that. So very I don't quick know if they're way to keep it. Don't you feel like people, you'd lose a lot of merchandise that way? Yeah. Like when you were in the airport and they had that mobile checkout thing, I guess, do they know when you walk out with something you didn't pay for? I don't know. 
It's pretty cool though. Pretty cool. Did you go really early? No, yeah. There's Trendy. I used to call that Trend, and my friend Brooke was like, it's Trendy. Get it? Like, Trendy? I didn't. I just now <laughs> I know, that. right? I didn't get that either. Thanks. Thanks, Brooke. So this has been a fun day date, Lindsay. Thank you for um, joining me. I had a very me. good time. I mean, I think I canceled out my exercise with the... Uh, with the truffle fries and the filet mignon, but uh, yeah, but we still have 8.6 miles to get home. Yeah, it's gonna be great. Look at this fun splash pad. It's Georgia would love this. We really have to pick up Georgia. It is 2:11, and Georgia's out of school at three. We can do this. We got this. <laughs> Look at him having a blast. Awesome. Flips happening in the middle. Yeah. Thanks for watching, and remember, you, you like, like our vibe, vibe? You should subscribe. Oh yeah. See you next time. I hope our bikes are up there. Okay, this just in, our bikes are still here on the bridge. It worked. If you ever see any bikes here at Disney Springs, it's probably us. you'll know they're ours. So just leave us a note. Thank you. <laughs>